What's up, YouTube? I uh, figured I might as well pump out a few videos while I'm, I have some spare time. So, basically, I just did the APRS video, and now we're going to go over uh, the Wires X um, system. So, the first thing that you want to do to use Wires X is you want to look uh, on this website that I have below, and it's going to tell you all the local, like, Wires X repeaters um, or nodes that you can get into, and what you want to do is this, you want to change, um, you could go, you could cha it set it as a channel or you could just go into VFO mode and you want to put in the frequency of um, the uh, channel or the, um, the the wires X that you're trying to get into. So in this case, I'm here in Richmond, Kentucky, I'm trying to get to Lexington and the frequency for it is 444125. Now you could do FM, uh, it doesn't really matter what mode because it'll change automatically. But to connect to the wires X, set it to the frequency. If there, if there's a tone squelch involved, you know, set that in here um, from the display menu, and then go up to signaling, and then go to um, tone squelch frequency, and you can set that there. So once we're here, uh, you'll hit the DX button and hold it in. And that'll ping the uh, the repeater there, and if everything goes right, you should see a signal come in, and then you'll be connected. So now I know that I'm connected here, and I don't really see anybody in here. But I am going to call CQ before I start messing around with the repeater, just to make sure nobody's here. CQ, this is Kilo November Four, my Kilo Bravo. Yeah, so there's nobody in here, so I can mess around with the settings a little bit. But once you're in Wires X, you'll notice you can't change frequencies or anything like that. Um, if you've connected to it a, a room before, you can use this um, to kind of change and see. But you'll hold in this band button right here, and it's going to come up with some settings. Now you can go to your local news, international news, and this and that. But uh, I'm going to show you guys how to join like a room. Uh, like it's kind of like a chat room. It's See, you're connected to the repeater, which is connected to the internet. You can connect the repeater to certain channels, and then you can talk on those channels. So you go and hit this, and it's going to, uh, or you hit your select or display button, and it's going to query the uh, repeater there for all the channel lists, and it's going to send it to your radio. And it should come up with a list here, and it shows maybe 10 at a time, uh, and then it'll have to query and ask for more. So just for the sake of it, we're going to go into American link uh, you can see um, if you hit the display button it'll automatically start to connect to it and in a few seconds you should see a connected and you'll if you're going to a popular channel like this you should start hearing people talk but you say it's not connected there we go so now it's connected but it did not connect to the right one, so we'll try that again. I'm a little far out right now, so there's a possibility the data just didn't come through okay. Um, we'll try it again. Hmm. Well, we'll try a different one. It could be full or something like that. So we'll go to uh, Texas Nexus. And there we go. So it connected the Texas Nexus. Um, I'll just go back and um, you'll see the room that's it's connected here. And uh, I'll just go ahead and call on and show you guys how this kind of works. Pretty much you can just push the talk and call up um, the room. CQ, this is Kilo November 4, my Kilo Bravo. Apparently nobody's listening in, but I am connected to the room. Um, and that's how that goes. So, um, uh, I'm gonna show you guys how to disconnect now. To disconnect from the room, you're gonna hit your star button on your hand mic and you're gonna hold it in. It's kind of courtesy if you're using like a small repeater to just dis, uh, disconnect from the room. 
uh, before you leave it and let it return to its default. But I think I'm just so far away right now, it's taken a few tries to handle some situations. So it, it disconnected that time. So ordinarily this repeater is going to automatically connect back to the Lexington repeater. Uh, to get it out of uh, wires X mode, you, you're going to hold in this DX mode again, or this DX button, and it's just going to return you back here. And that's how that goes. That's how you uh, use the wires X function. Now, if you want to set up your call sign in wires X, I noticed that some people actually have um, their nickname, so I put mine in there. But you can go to 14 in my call sign digital, and uh, a lot of people they'll put like a hyphen or something like that and put their nickname. That way, people know what they're being called. Because once you talk in the uh, wires X mode, it shows your uh, call sign up at the top and how many miles are you are away. So, yeah, you can put your nickname in there or whatever, and um, just you know, make sure you have your call sign there. And that's how that goes. So if you guys have any questions or comments down in the description or something you'd like to see, just uh, let me know.